What's up guys, iDevice Help here and today in this video we're going to be comparing iOS 9.2.1 versus iOS 9.3 to see if you should update from 9.2.1 to 9.3 on the iPhone 4S. Now 9.3 could very well be the last update that Apple pushes out for the iPhone 4S. Now this is not confirmed information but with iOS 10 coming in the summer Apple will most likely drop support for the iPhone 4S, therefore leaving iOS 9.3 as the last update for you iPhone 4S owners. And should you update in this video, I'm going to be giving a few tests of the performance of both devices. Let's go ahead and start both devices at the same time to see which one boots up faster. So it looks like iOS 9.2.1 did boot up faster on the iPhone 4S. 9.3, there it is, came in a few seconds behind. Now that was the boot up test on both of these iPhones. And as you can see, they're launching applications and going through the menus. iOS 9.2.1 seems to be performing better as well. As you can see there, 9.2.1 on the left and 9.3 on the right. Let's do some more tests. Launching the multitasker. 9.2 in my opinion took that one. Let's try it again. About the same. Control center. Uh, just about the same. Just about the same minor delay on 9.3. I don't know if you guys can really tell. Let's go to notification center. One more time. Just about the same. Now let's go ahead and hit the spotlight search. One, two, three. Just about the same. All right, so now let's just kind of like switch through applications. All right, so now let's try launching folders. Looks to be about just the same amount of speed. And what I'm going to do next is quit out all applications here and do a Geekbench test on both devices. 9.2.1 on the left and 9.3 on the right. So let's go ahead and start. All right, so it looks like iOS and 9.2.1 and also 9.3 score identical in terms of performance. So you can see there the single core score of 217, multi core score of 411. And if we scroll down, we can see that these devices are in fact a 9.3 and a 9.2.1 so now let's go ahead and bring up Siri what's the weather in Tokyo again 9.2.1 faster than 9.3 let's do one more what's 5 times 20 it's 100 the answer is 100 so you can see again, 9.2.1 faster than 9.3 as well. All right, so now let's go ahead and launch Safari and do a browser test, or at least a loading test for the browser and also the scrolling. So let's go ahead and click the both Apple websites there. Looks like 9.3 came in a little bit faster in terms of the browser speed. Now scrolling is determined by Apple in a way. Uh, they do adjust the speed themselves. This doesn't really mean one device is performing faster than the other in terms of scrolling. But both devices seem to be scrolling at the same speed, at least here on this Apple website. So according to this video, iOS 9.2.1 did perform better than 9.3. Now even though the Geekbench scores were exactly the same identical, it looks like the performance is a bit faster on 9.2.1. Yes, I do know 9.3 is in the final stages of the beta, but it shouldn't be as slow as it seemed on this video. So we could well be living in the last days of the iPhone 4S. Most likely Apple will drop support when iOS 10 drops in the near future this summer. So if you guys enjoyed this video, any questions or thoughts, leave them down below. Be sure to click that like button. Much more videos coming your way. It's been iDevice Help, and I will catch you guys on the next one. Peace.